Welcome back to another Reason Session. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel, and leave any questions you have in the comment section. As you all know, Reason 13 is finally here. This won't be an in-depth tutorial, but I'll go over some of the new tools and features while I'm creating. First, when you double-click a block in the instrument lane, it opens the edit window at the bottom of the screen. If you want to zoom the piano roll vertically, there's an area behind the piano keys that you click, hold, and move left and right. And to zoom horizontally, there's an area at the top of the piano roll that you click, hold, and move up and down. Now let's lay down some chords. When you want to quantize or make any edits, all your tools are on the left side of the edit window now. Let's bring these chords to life with some portal. Now let's add a dark synth bass from the Mini V. Let's lay down some notes and add the new Ripley space delay.
Let's adjust some of the other settings. Now in Reason 13, we can transpose multiple MIDI lanes at once by selecting all the notes and right-clicking. I like to open the Edit window first. Right-click, go down and open the Transpose Notes window. Here you have an option to how many notes you want to transpose. To move up one, you simply set it to one and press Transpose. When you only set it to one, it only moves up one at a time. If you want to move down one at a time, you set it to minus one. If you want to move up or down a whole octave, you use these up and down buttons. The random button, I don't use at all. Let's add some vocals from the Wave Runners Bundle 2.0. Here I've laid down some drums and added Reason 13's new gain tool to the kick. I'll let the beat play out from here. <laughs> 